welcome to another unturned video today we're going to go on a new unturned map called antarctica now this map was originally an april fools map but after playing it for a bit alone it is actually quite a good map for pvp and survival in general and that is what we're going to do today if you guys enjoyed this video and want to see more like this let's aim for 500 likes if we reach that goal i will play on antarctica more also subscribe if you haven't already we are going to reach 30,000 subscribers very very soon and i would really appreciate it today we're going to roll a mythical giveaway which is a firefly kitsune mask to have a chance to win this make sure that you have liked subscribed and comment something below Channel members also have a higher chance to win, so if someone wishes to become a member, the link will be in the description below. Welcome to today's sponsored video brought to you by Factor75. Say goodbye to meal prep and hello to delicious chef-crafted meals delivered straight to your doorstep. Factor75 is not your average meal delivery service. Their meals are carefully crafted by dietitians to ensure optimal nutritional value without sacrificing taste. In a world where fast food is king, Factor 75 offers a more convenient and healthier option. Personally, I find it to be a game changer when it comes to saving time and maintaining a healthy diet, so I not give it a try. By using my link below or heading to factor75.com and entering the code FACTORSE. 3 g 179 you can enjoy a whopping 50% off your first box. Don't miss out on this amazing opportunity to experience the ultimate in convenience and nutrition. And let's get straight into the video. Alright boys, Antarctica. Now I have never played on this map. Apparently it is an April Fool's map, but we have just joined a server. Uh, it's two times loot, nothing that insane. But yeah, there are some people on the server, I have no idea where I actually am. Or no, it's a barbed wire has spawned, okay. Now apparently it is a huge map, it is very very big. It's, it's insane size, so it's like four times bigger than Russia. Yeah, we're currently freezing to death as well. I wonder what will happen if we actually jump off. Wait, am I... oh. Oh, uh, I'm dead. Okay. Alright, great start. Yeah, there are some people on the server. There's two trios. Now, obviously, as always, we're going to... First of all, I'm going to try to figure out what this map actually is. Now, I've also noticed that we have spawned with very little food and water. So, we're going to need to find that very, very soon. And I'm noticing that there are literally no trees around. So, I don't know how we're going to build a base. So, probably we're going to need to salvage a billion items. And yeah, there's a vehicle right over here. Okay, well, it's stuck. It's a new vehicle. I've never seen that before. Yeah, we're losing HP at the same time as well. There's a lot of, like, buildables everywhere. Like, random buildables people placed. And there's a bed that's claimed. Bro, this is so confusing. Oh, there's a guy over there. Hello. I hit him. Dude, he's so low. I hit him, like, three times. Oh, yeah, he's running away. Another headshot. Come back here, bro. Another one. Dude, he's so weak. How is he not dead? Oh, I'm dead. I froze to death. Nice. An airdrop is passing by. Bro, I am so confused. I wait, what? I hear House Fury and Night Trader. Fussy lot as well. There's an insane base over here. Bro, this is so confusing. Yeah, Night Trader shots. Right, so the map is kind of weird as well. Like, there's a huge part of it where it's just emptiness, and then there's like a bunch of marked locations. I don't know if there's actually going to be anywhere we get loot from those areas. Oh yeah, there actually is. There's some. Oh, there's some zombies. Hold on. So it's like one zombie drops two items, two random items. Clearly an umbrella and a vest. I'm pretty sure they're gonna be dropping like guns as well. I hear somebody in. Okay, somebody shooting MK2. Yeah, this is zombie stuff. Give me a gun, please. And okay, he gave me a bouncy charge and doorways. <laughs> nice. I assume that's how you're gonna get base building parts. Oh, blunt force. Oh, there's a lot of zombies. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm gonna die. I'm dead. Great. There's an airdrop here. Oh, it actually has loot. Um, blowtorch. I was kind of hoping for guns, but this is okay. I mean, we have a small vault in the server, so we're gonna put ourselves the blowtorch and the bed. And the med kit. Put everything in it, why not? Alright, there's a couple of zombies. Oh, and there's a guy. He's a machete. I hear a lot of shots in the background, man. Some random junk. I'm almost dead. So let's just salvage these. Get ourselves a little dressing. I mean, I'm pretty sure I have a med kit in my vault, so I'm gonna actually use that. Get ourselves to full HP. And I'm dead, never mind. That's not a med kit. That was a bomb. Lovely, yeah. Right, thankfully I didn't have anything good. Wait, what? There's a polar bear. Oh damn, he's strong. Oh, we killed oh and I I died. Bro, I killed him though. I keep dying so much in this map, man. I need to find myself an actually gun. If I get myself oh wait, we spawned here. This is where I killed him. What did he drop? Some loot over here. Oh he dropped a gun, okay. And the mannequin. Nice. We'll put that mannequin right over there and let's put our cosmetics. Right, we got ourselves a bulldog. So now we're gonna do an insane wreck searches, ladies and gentlemen. There's a makeshift vehicle over here. I'm pretty sure, like, with, you can get literally anything from killing zombies or polar bears or... Oh, there's a guy. Hold on, let's go closer because there's a bulldog. And he's dead. And we got a house fury. Let's kill these zombies. Oh, there's another guy. Oh, I'm out of ammo. 
dead. I need some med up. Oh yeah, this guy's stacked. He has all a bunch of guns. He has med dressing. Hopefully this doesn't explode. Now we good. Okay. All right, let's go check out what this dude over here had. Oh, this guy is geared as well. Hold on, let's kill the zombie. Our oh, vehicle blew up. All right, yeah, the zombie's dead. All right, let's put some stuff in vault actually. Like some guns. Get ourselves a Swiss giver as well. Not my ideal gun to use. Better than nothing. Alright, let's med up. Get ourselves to full HP again. Now the problem is I don't know where I'm gonna store all of this loot. Get ourselves an Elise pack. Lovely. Locker. Bounce charge. Bulldog. That's another bulldog. That wasn't mine. I hear steps. There's a guy screaming. He's dead. Let's go. I didn't have anything that good though. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Let's go figure out where we're gonna put all of this loot. Man, we got ourselves some pretty decent items, I guess. All right, so I'm gonna place the locker down over here. Um, we'll put, like, the best items, maybe, like, just the ammo. I don't really have anything else worth putting. I hear Maple Strike. I definitely want that. Yeah, we could put the House Fury over there. Now, somebody said that there's, like, igloos that we could take over. So that would be pretty good, actually. All we would need is just a door. Yeah, somebody's shooting very, very close. With Swiss Gewehr. Let's go check out what the hell is actually going on. Yeah, here's steps. There's a guy here. He's dead. My guy had a grizzly fussy lot. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Alright, he's dead. I almost died there, actually. Yeah, this guy's stacked as well. Let's kill the zombie. We got ourselves a grizzly, so that's pretty good. We got ourselves an actual raiding weapon. Dragon Fang box. A bunch of decorations. Adaptive. I'm pretty sure down there there's even more guns. For now, let's just hide over here so that we can actually organize our inventory a bit and put good items in our vault. Especially the grizzly. I don't want to lose the grizzly. Sunny shows up up here. They're not even going to realize that I'm up here. It's kind of funny. We'll put the bouncy charges in vault. Get ourselves an ornamental tree. Oh yeah, there's somebody. I hear them walking. No, he's right. Bro, he's actually clueless. He has no clue about me. Oh, I hear shots. There's a sentry down here as well. Imagine we get a hostile sentry and generator and just place it wherever we want. Yeah, a lot of shots are going on. Let's go actually try to kill him. My guy's using a Nike Rev. It's a zombie. I thought that was a person. Oh, there's a person down below me though. And he's dead. There's another dude. No, oh, he's up there. He's running away. He's dead. My guy didn't have anything. This dude has... Yeah, he doesn't even have gun either. I thought he did. He had ammo though, which is what I need right now. Right, let's take everything so we can salvage them. Get ourselves some easy dressings. Calling car drum. Let's met up. Yeah, the magazine. Blowtorch. Yeah, these dudes didn't have anything else though. It's a filter. I don't think they're used though in this map. Oh, I hear a vehicle. Yeah, we, we found an igloo though. This is what I've been looking for this whole time. We're just gonna make ourselves a door, which is quite simple. Oh, he dropped a heartbreaker. Oh, that's really good. Yeah, you could salvage scopes. Like vanilla scopes on this map. Before, you couldn't do that. Alright, we'll place the door there. And we got ourselves our own insane igloo. It's actually not that small. But honestly, we don't really need that much of space. We just need ourselves a bed, some lockers. And that's literally it. Problem is, I don't have a bed. Or lockers on me. So we're gonna have to find those. I'm pretty sure I have a blowtorch. Actually, we do have a bed. Oh, lovely. But we are very close to an actually to an area where you could loot. So that means that people are gonna be coming over here. So we're gonna get ourselves hopefully a lot of kills with that. Well, I left a lot of the loot at base. Came over here and looted here. Didn't really get anything that good though. Just a Yuri safe zone generator. I'm dead. Wait, what? Where am I? Bro, I'm stuck. I can't get out. I'm gonna die. Bro, what the hell? <laughs> Alright, yeah. D I died. Alright, well, I am back in base. Uh, I did get myself some loot to get myself a pretty decent loot run. There's people outside my base, though. So I'm just gonna be quiet for now so they wouldn't even hear me. Yeah, they're still out there. It's kinda scary, man. I'm not gonna, uh, I'm not gonna lie. Especially the fact that I only am inside the... An igloo, which is quite small. But yeah, I do get myself a night trader, some random junk. In my vault, I do have Heartbreaker, Grizzly, three bouncy charges. Maybe I could go out and try to kill him, actually. I mean, I do have a night trader, it's a pretty good gun. Scared I would lose every. Oh, yeah, he's right over here. I saw him. Alright, he's dead. Let's take all of the loot. Yeah, he has Aug, a bunch of junk. He had a gauss mask as well. Alright, easy loot. Now we're back in base. I hear more steps, but now we just, we just chill inside. Place ourselves all of these buildables that we can actually use them as storage. Ourselves another counter. 
I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get door camped, so what I can do is that I can suicide and try to get myself a pretty good spawn and we could loot there in peace. Are they trying grenades? Oh no, they throw smoke. If they do try to raid, I do have a blowtorch and yeah, it'll be easy. Let's put all of this junk in here. Get ourselves an AUG as well, lovely. Right, there's a lot of shots. So I did suicide and put the gun in vault and I'm over here, there's a guy. Literally right over there. This is a separate igloo, this is not my igloo. I hear somebody very close. He's dead. He had a blunt force. Lovely. There's another dude. Hello there. There's two guys. <sighs> I'm gonna back up. Bro, the zombie's annoying. Go away. I hear somebody in an APC or whatever that is. Helicopter too. What the hell? Oh, I'm... I came up from behind me, man. Oh, I spawned right here. Hold on. I do have guns in vault. You have the grizzly. I'm gonna use the grizzly then. He's right over there. He's clueless. Hit him. Hit him again. Bro, I had to hit him three times with a grizzly. It's fine though, he's dead. Yeah, that's all my loot and the house fury. Lovely. Right, maybe we should get out of here then. Yeah, let's put the nitrate there in our vault. Alright, so our igloo is starting to look pretty nice actually. It's got a ton of decorations, got ourselves a ton of guns as well. Got ourselves a rifle rack. Well, alright guys, after that I did pretty much leave. There was nothing else to do. I do like this map, it's kind of fun to play here and there, but after a while it did get boring. After all, it was an April Fool's map, but it's actually kind of smart the way that they executed it. The fact that you can get literally everything from zombies. The fact that there are random igloos everywhere, meaning that you can still survive on this map. But yeah, if you guys do enjoy this video and do want to see more in the future, let me know in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Bye!